to uphold that speed route and you can see the size of it that's in a third on top of a 30 litre pot that gives you an idea that's my full hand you know <laughs> it doesn't touch anywhere so You all right everyone quick little video the old woman next door to us asked if i had any parsnips growing i said i so she asked if i'll take a two up so i pulled a few out of the box to take up her. um you know they're not too bad at all You know, I'll fucking measure this. Whoops, a daisy. Nineteen inches. And then there was another one that fell on the floor. Sorry. Then there's that one. That one. Eight and three quarter inches. Then I've got that one, which is nineteen inches. So you know that's a, a nice parsnip, and just in case anyone thinks that I haven't grown these ones, I've got I've kept one with a green on. So I'm just going to cut the green off Right And that one measures in at Spot on 19 inches So they're not too bad at all, considering every other time I've tried to grow them, I've never got no bigger than like eight or nine inches. So I'm gonna give them a few more months yet anyway. Uh, but I just thought I would make a quick video on them. So I would surmise when they're cleaned off and all that, the old woman will enjoy them. I pulled that speed out and you can see the size of it that's in a third on top of a 30 litre pot that gives you an idea that's my full hand you know <laughs> it doesn't touch anywhere so i'll cut it cut it down trim it off and all that then i'll show you the actual size so there it is all top and tailed i'll try and Put it in one hand so you can see. It's bloody heavy, I can tell you that. I take it home, I'm going to measure the circumference of it. I'll let you know what it is. So I've got the sweet back one. Um, I'm going to measure it. Because I'm old school, I'll do it in inches. And we'll go around, oops, round the widest part. If you can see, I know the camera's back to front, back facing, but 25 and a half inches. I don't know what that equates to in centimetres. Um, I will try and do it. Whoops, quick get up. 
in centimeters, sixty-five, sixty-five centimeters. Um, so as I say, quite a big Swede by standard Swede sizes. You know, it's not. It's nothing compared to the giant veg. But when you compare it to a standard size sweet, that is really, really big. So, apart from pulling that one out, um, I pulled a couple more courgettes out. So, we'll measure the courgette. The one I had the other day, I think, was 15 and a half inches. So, I'll measure the big one I've got here, and we'll see what that one equates to as well, eh? So I'm going to measure the two, I forget them, courgettes. So in inches again, get that one there. I'm not taking in the end of it. So it comes from there to the end, which is 11 inches. Now we're going to the bigger one. So you can see I'm just putting that on the end there, look. Just so you can see I'm not taking the root to the very end. That's just where you chop it off. So I'm going to put there to the end 14 inches. So not as big as the one the other day, which was just over 15 and a quarter inches. But definitely a good size. <laughs> 